All right, so now I'm gonna be talking about my favorites. First off, I'm just gonna randomly grab from this chair that I have stuff on, and I'm gonna just grab Airspun. It's actually called Cody Airspun Loose Face Powder. A lot of you have asked me about this. I've talked about it. I've talked about it before, but a lot of you still ask me. I I grabbed the naturally neutral uh, shade, and I use this to bake my my face with it, to set my under eye, to set a whole bunch of stuff because it really keeps me uh, dry and matte as much as possible. So I love this stuff and it smells really good. I bought it at Walmart. It's usually by the nail and nail section on the very bottom shelf. It's around six or seven bucks. You get a lot and I've been having it for a while and I love it so yeah. I would recommend it to you so much. And next is this new brand that, well it's new to me but I love it. It's a very natural it's a, it's just a natural cosmetic line and it's called Painted Earth Cosmetics from Nature. I absolutely love it. This is Boo Boo Gel. It's beautiful. It's, um, what it says is it's smooth on daily for blemish free skin. Um, it says grab for large pores, burns, bites, and small cuts. So I basically put this on for anything, any kind of boo boo that I have, literally boo boo. So yeah, I love it. You know why I love it? Because it has organic aloe vera gel, a whole bunch of other things that I can't pronounce, but they're all natural. It has green tea, white tea, pepper, peppermint oil, arnica, which I love too. So yeah, thank you so much to Painted Earth. You guys made my whole life. I seriously love it. Next is this deep cleansing pore strips from Biore. My nose usually tends to get really ugly because it, like my pores get off nasty and like I love peeling it off and like getting all the stuff and looking at it and it's like it looks nasty so yeah I love this stuff I use it what twice a week or something and now we're gonna pick up NYC New York color eyeliner liquid eyeliner I got this new one because the one I'm currently using I it rubbed off so yeah favorite eyeliner right now I used to love or I still love the wet n wild one but se me acababa bien rápido like it, it would be over like in a week and this is bigger the wand is bigger too I don't know it just lasts longer and it's cheap too it's like the same price so next I'm gonna talk about a blush that I haven't used in a while but I recently found it in my my stuff it's called Luminoso by Milani I have it on my face, I don't know if you can tell. And I don't know if I've talked about Anastasia's concealer, but I've been using this forever, and I don't think I've ever talked about it. This is in the shade 2.0. It's a little bit dark for my skin, but it blends really well, and it covers all my dark spots that I usually have. And I use it for my eyebrows too. The consistency is just so good because it's thick, but it like blends out really well. So yeah, if you ever get to try it, I'll recommend it to you because I love it. And next is another eyeliner. This is from Bella Terra Mineral Cosmetics. It's a beautiful pencil. It's black and it's really tall from the tip. It just really helps out with the wing that I make. And it's really dark and I really like it. So big thank you to Bella Terra. Big thank you to Bella Terra. I love you guys. Speaking of Bella Terra, I have three mineral shadows that I really love that they sent me over. They're like this loose mineral. They're really shimmery, really pretty. My favorite right now is called Birch. Let me see if you can see that. It's super pretty. It's like a pink, like dusty rose color. And then this green one, it's called Stem. Beautiful. It kind of matches this wall a little bit. And then... Amethyst, Amethyst, I don't know, it's that gray shadow that I used not too long ago and I really liked it too. So yeah, I'm almost done guys. And if you're wondering what's on my lips right now, it's two of my favorites. It is the Sephora Lip Liner. It's in the shade Radiant Rosy 14. So I put that all over my lips and then I put on Bella Terra Mineral Lip Gloss on top of it. So it's like a brownish. It's not sticky, it has a really cool vanilla scent to it, and it's just beautiful. 
So yeah. And then I also love this oil-free eye makeup remover by Neutrogena. It just like takes off all my makeup all, every night. So awesome. And then I'm gonna just give this little shout out, this little, how do you Eyelash curlers, pinzas, I don't know. I don't use these for my lashes, I use these for my falsies. Stick in my falsie because sometimes my falsies come out like this and it's like, no dude. I think that's about it. Oh, and then what I've been using on my face for foundation is this Harlot Cosmetics Afterglow Foundation. It's in the color H3. They sent it over to me uh, not too long, yeah, long ago, actually. But this color just matches me so well, and I love it. And it's like a really good glow. It covers, and it's really liquidy. It comes out super liquidy, but yeah, that's what I use on my face now. So yeah, I think that's it. That is all my favorites, current favorites. It's not a May favorites because, I don't know, the months just fly by nowadays and I can't keep up with that. So it's just my current favorites. I was just kidding, this is not the end. Okay, I have favorite brushes for you guys. I think I should make a whole different video on my favorite brushes and what I use them for and where I got them and what I use them for because they're all different types of brushes like Oh my god, I love brushes. Yeah, I'm gonna make a whole video on brushes, so keep an eye out for that video. Bye guys. I love working with smaller brands because I get to see how much... I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> okay, so, but... Am I going like this too much? Because when I talk, I go like this. Because I'm thinking about what I'm saying. <laughs>